team just seems to be able to keep the ball so easily against us so we're not going into this game with with high confidence not at all in fact it looks like i've also forgotten wow <laughs> it's not going well for us in this in this uh in these coming these past weeks i've forgotten to uh, rest some of my players but we do want to play Addy amy
shooter, but wow, somehow we still have the ball here. You can see no obvious choices. An interesting tackle. We can look for that ball to the back post um, on the left because of how tall Costa is. That could be a good outlet, actually. But Venezia playing like prime Barcelona at the moment. I mean, Jesus, really? Wasn't doing well there. Very well. Hello. I thought that was going to lift over him. Unfortunately not. <laughs> this is just really like sluggish. We feel it was like I'm playing with like a League One team or something. They're able to just pass it. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> We're able to pump. We're not able to stop any of their passing play whatsoever. And they always seem to play the very kind of frustrating. Even that header, we couldn't find anyone with it. Just, I mean, I kind of have to wait for them to bring it forward. Otherwise, they're just going to play it around and around and around. I mean, <laughs> there's nothing really I can do about those passes. I, I've I'm kind of lost for what I can do, to be quite honest. I wasn't making that pass. <laughs> Sorry if I seem like really frustrated. It's just every single game at the moment just seems. 
seems like we can't we can't do anything right. Why is he past it there? He's offside, isn't he? Why? Why? <laughs> why has he passed it to him? And why is he offside? We aren't going to win this game. It's just not possible. It just feels really, really hard to, to get to string anything together. I mean, no one seems to be in any good sort of position to at all. Okay, how we can do this? I, there's nothing we can do. I've just got to keep, like, we've got 18 minutes. Just hope we don't lose. Literally, hope we don't lose. We've got Nanny. <laughs> hey, why is he in so much space? I can't do anything. <laughs>
know they'd win maybe they were two points behind us but yeah with that they go two points ahead and we just don't look like we are we have any confidence at all and to be honest it's because I don't <laughs> I don't have any confidence we just look so nervous on the ball we're slow I mean hopefully it's going to be different because we've, we're playing full side out now but um, I don't know I don't know this is um, this is it isn't it guys really I did say before the start of um, the Venice game that um, if we lost them that means that we could be conceding Syria and even so even playing our full side with a goal advantage we could quite easily lose here as well and if we do we'll be out of the Champions League um, and we have a, a and then we have a mountain to climb in the league as well here we go we've got the advantage just nothing stupid now guys we've got a full <laughs> oh my god please no <laughs> we started slowly and poorly in the first in the first leg as well uh, so no matter what happens we need to keep our head because it all comes down to this we don't lose then we're through simple as some nervous passes going on nice back post ok or not 1-0 we are 1-0 up we are 1-0 up Addy Amy not who I tried to pass to I try to go back post but I'll take it alright guys we are winning <laughs> we are winning As we know from experience in the previous episode, going a man down 
does not necessarily mean it's a foregone conclusion. Anthony has had a very good game. He's had a very, very good game so far. I think he's did he assist both? You see, look at this. A man down yet. They are still coming forward and flooding forward. But I feel no. Oh my god, we could counterattack quite easily. And that is happening. Addy Amy coming down the left hand side this time. Keeps hold of it. Plays it to Hernandez. Who gets a bit of space to the back post. I didn't want to go to the back post, but he did. Kessie looking for Reina. Hopefully Tanali can get on that. He can't. But I mean, it, it, look, if we lose, if we don't progress past um, PSG with a three goal advantage and a man up, well, then we don't deserve to go through. So that kind of takes the pressure off, if you know what I mean. I think he's off. He's not. Hello? Why, why do I say he's offside? And then, I mean, we, we should have scored again. That's what they always say not to do, and I did it. Well, that's half time. That is half time, guys. And we have a three goal advantage and a man up. And we deserve to be winning. It's fully deserved. I'm going to bring Rainer off. We're going to bring Elliot on. He didn't play well in the first leg, to be fair. Relatively, he had a couple of missed touches, didn't he? But this, this half, I think we just, you know, slow it down a little bit. Make a couple of fouls. You know, there's no need to uh, be so aggressive in attacking. I mean, being aggressive is actually probably quite a good idea. Nice. That's good. Hello. Wow. Elliot is through. Boom. That's game. That is game. We are into the final of the Champions League. I'm saying it now. An absolutely wonderful run by Harvey Elliott. Onto the ball. Almost scored himself off the post and straight into the path of the Champions League top goal scorer. The, like I've said before, un unsung hero. Liao, and it looks like we could be through again, and Liao's there once again, a great save this time by Donnarumma, but to be honest, we, we look like we're bossing the game now, we're winning by, by four goals, and we're good for it as well, back post, hello, That's, <laughs> that is four, to be fair, with a man up, Playing this well at the San Zero, I am absolutely not surprised that we're doing this now. Addy Amy was at the back post. Um, wow, I did not. Sorry, Kessie was at the back post. I saw Addy Amy celebrating. I actually said Kessie initially, <laughs> but yeah, I think as long as we don't do the worst cock up in Champions League history now. Famous last words. Um, Mbappe scores a bizarre goal. Uh, I don't know what happened there, but our centre back split, let him through, and he just chips our goalkeeper from the edge of the box. A wonderful goal, and there's half an hour left. I can't see them getting five goals. Um, although we're doing our best to uh, give them hope, it would be interesting if. Uh, PSG came back from a 6-1 deficit, rings, rings are similarly to the, uh, oh my god, okay offside right, I think we get, a few, you know, 70 minutes in, 5 more minutes without conceding, um, and that will be it, I can't see them getting that many goals in that amount of time, just simply isn't really possible and we are through again, they are really putting everyone forward, it looks like that that. It's sweaty, it's disgusting, it's AC Milan, 
regardless of the result here, we will leave the Champions League final to its own game. I think we lose this, the league is gone. We lose this, the league is gone. And what's annoying is I think we've actually been, um, we have to win the league to like keep our job. So, I mean, we, end, we could end up like, we lose our job. That would be really annoying. I wish there was a way you could change it so that you can't be sacked. Because, I, I don't know, I mean, I guess that's not very... <laughs> Boys, what is this passing about? Jesus. It's obviously not realistic, but I kind of just want to do like an AC Milan rebuild, which means I just want to stay within, with um, AC Milan. We need to focus here, I'm not being... Do that. My God, thank the Lord for that. What they're, they're pressing hard. <laughs> All right, Chiesa, Jesus. Anthony now, go on. Who's that? Oh, bloody Kyle Walker. Of course they've signed him, and of course that's who he was trying to sprint against.
save by Chesney there. Keeper of uh, Addy Amy's not a bad shout, to be quite honest. That's terrible from the out. No, 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 no. 
trying to stop the stupid short passing stuff. Go on. Go on, Anthony. Go on. Fairly. 